Let's talk about insects and how do we call them in Dutch. Hallo lieve vrienden. So let's start with the obvious ones. The most common insects in the Netherlands. Um, I will name them in this video. And uh, first off, the Dutch word for insect is the same word, which is insect. So only the emphasis is on the second part uh, of the word instead of in the first part in English. So it's insect. So an obvious one is a fly in Dutch is een vlieg. And the fly is de vlieg. And the same as in English, um, flying is uh, not only the insect, but also um, the verb flying, right? So um, if you say a fly flies, that is in Dutch, een vlieg vliegt. I see a fly flying. Ik zie een vlieg vliegen. All right, so that is a fly. Uh, let's talk about a mosquito. That is just a three-letter word in Dutch, which is een mug, or the mosquito is de mug. In the summer, I am annoyed a lot by mosquitoes. In the zomer, heb ik veel last van muggen. An ant in Dutch is een mier. So, the ant is de mier. In my backyard, I have a lot of ants. In mijn achtertuin heb ik veel mieren. A bee in Dutch is een bij. And a wasp is een wesp. So you can say in the summer we see a lot of bees and wasps. In the zomer zien we veel bijen en wespen. A beetle is een kever. And that is also the name of a car. Like the old vintage car by Volkswagen. And that is also called a kever. A spider in Dutch is een spin. And a cockroach, we don't have a lot of them in, in the Netherlands. The Dutch word for cockroach is kakkerlak. And uh, we do see a lot of butterflies. And the Dutch word for butterfly is vlinder. Ik zag vandaag een mooie vlinder means I saw a beautiful butterfly today. A dragonfly, I love the English word for this insect, dragonfly. In Dutch, that is called Een libelle. And finally, also in the Netherlands, you see a, a lot of ladybirds. That is just a small type of beetle, right? So we call that een lieve heersbeesje. That's a really long word, right? And they, those are really beautiful and we see them a lot. So these were the examples I wanted to give you. Practice them and I'll see you in the next lesson. If this lesson was helpful, please give it a like and please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon so you won't miss a single lesson. Also, if you want to develop your Dutch proficiency even faster, reach out to me for private lessons by sending me a DM or an email. Tot ziens!